Welcome back friends. I'm so glad that you are joining us for the first time or again for our Young at Heart worship with East Dallas Christian Church. Today is a great day to learn about God. Today we are going to be reading a book called What is God? The idea for this uh, lesson today came from a conversation I had with my toddler where we were driving and asking about who made things and where does everything come from? And we were talking about God and she said, who is God? And I paused and I wondered, how do I answer such a big question to a little toddler? So we continued talking about it and I remembered this book and thought it would be a wonderful thing to share with our families today as we may be wondering together, who and what is God? Our first song this morning is Kumbaya, which means come by here. We sing this a lot at nap time or bedtime as a way to get calm and thank God for our day. Usually, uh, my toddler gets to pick the words that we do. So one of our words will be uh, silly when we get to that point, and another one will be someone's singing when we get there as well. Kumbaya, my Lord, kumbaya, kumbaya, my Lord, kumbaya, kumbaya, my Lord, kumbaya, oh Lord, kumbaya, someone silly, Lord, Kumbaya, someone silly, Lord. Kumbaya, someone silly, Lord. Kumbaya, oh Lord. Kumbaya, someone singing, Lord. Kumbaya, someone singing, Lord. Kumbaya, someone singing, Lord, Kumbaya, oh Lord, Kumbaya. Our next song is one from my childhood camp growing up, and it's really fun and energetic, and technically you're supposed to speed it up at each round, but also skip words at each round as it gets harder and harder. I'm just gonna sing it through twice since I'm not sure how many of us know it since I'm transplanting it over here from Georgia, but it is a favorite of mine. He is my rock, my sword, my shield. He's the hub in the middle of the wheel. The lily of the valley, my bright and morning star. Makes no difference what you say. I'll get on my knees and pray. Pray until the day that Jesus comes. Yeehaw! He's my rock, my sword, my shield. He's the hub in the middle of the wheel. Lily of the valley, my bright and morning star. Makes no difference what you say. I'll get on my knees and pray. Pray until the day that Jesus comes. Yeehaw! As we prepare to move into our scripture and story, let us join together in singing Be Still. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. This morning we have two scriptures picked out to help us understand who and what is God. First, from the beginning of Psalm 18, I love you, O Lord, my strength. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, my deliverer, my God, my rock in whom I take refuge, my shield, the horn of salvation, my stronghold. And then from later, the last book of the Bible, from Revelation chapter 1, verse 8, I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is and was and is to come. Amen. Uh, do you remember a couple of weeks ago, you asked me, who is God? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, in the car. So today, we're going to read a book that's called What is God? by Olivia Bryan Updegrove. All right? So what is God? What is God? asked the small child. There's a lot about God, so this may take a while. You see, God is, was, and in the future will be. Huh? said the boy. That's, That's confusing to me. That's called a fiction. Yeah? So the man began to think and think, and he thought. Well, said the child, what have you got? The man looked at the child and took a deep sigh. <sighs> he sat on the floor and looked in his eyes. They looked at each other for a very long while. Then the man started to show a big smile. Can you show me a big smile? <laughs> God is so big, the man jumped up suddenly. God's part of the stars, the oceans, and the trees. God is in heaven, but God moves around. In all good things, God, God can be found. Heaven? God is in heaven, that's right. Why? That's where he lives. I live, Mary. She's up in heaven too. Then the boy began to repeat what was said. He wanted to get it worked out in his head. God is so big, part of you, part of me. God's part of the stars, the oceans, and the trees. God is in heaven, but God moves all around. In all good things, God can be found. Yes, said the man, there is so much more. We've only begun to open the door. God was there when all things began and continues with us till good wins in the end. God lets us choose, choose what is right and wrong. But God is beside us when we go along. God's at his house. You think God's at his house? Mm. Yeah, because God is everywhere. Stop, said the boy, and he stared at the man. Then once again, the boy said again, God is so big, part of you, part of me. God's part of the stars, the ocean, and trees. God is in heaven, but God moves around. In all good things, God can be found. Is the boy in heaven too? No, they're just showing how they love each other. God was there when all things began and continues with us till good wins in the end. God lets us choose what is right and is wrong, but God is beside us when we go along. The man once again sat next to the child. In silence, he held his hand for a while. So that's the man and the boy holding hands. Why? Because they love each other. We'll get there in a second. Then he spoke very soft to the curious eyes, who for such a young age seems so very wise. Like your best friend, God loves to hang out. God knows when you smile, play, and pout. But just like the grown-ups who love you and care, God gets upset when you're mean and unfair. So be smart, be kind. That's his friend. Maybe that's Landry. Maybe that's our friend Landry. Oh, made me. Yeah. Landry. Yeah. Those are parts of God, too. You see that good God stuff is inside of you. Let me see who that is. We'll keep reading and find out. Wow. God is so big, the boy told the man. But I think that I get it as you hold my hand. God is big, that is true, said the smiling old man. But God's not so big that God can't understand. God is still able to be close and small. God's part of the bugs and dirt and baseball. God gives faith and hope and love as our guide. These are the gifts to help on life's ride. They looked at each other for a very long while. Then the boy started to show a big smile. God is so big, the boy jumped suddenly. God's part of the stars, the oceans and trees. God is in heaven, but God moves around. In all good things, God can be found. God was there when all things began and continues with us till good wins in the end. God lets us choose what is right and is wrong, but God is beside us when we go along. Like my best friend, God loves to hang out. God knows when I smile and play and pout. Just like the grown-ups who love me and care, God gets upset when I'm mean and unfair. So be smart, be kind. Those are parts of God too. You see, that good God stuff is inside me too. Wow, 
God is so big, the boy shouted at the man. But God's not as big that God can't understand. God is still able to be close and small. God's part of the bugs, the dirt, and baseball. God gives faith and hope and love as our guide. These are the gifts that help us on life's ride. They were jumping together and laughing with joy. What a great God, said the small little boy. The man looked at the boy one more time and he said, A few more thoughts filled his head. Look in the scriptures and continue to pray, and you will find more about God every day. You will get older and things will get tough, but with God who is love, well, that's enough. And it was. Amen. Now let us wonder together. Remember, this is the portion of our service where we can pause the video to think about these wondering questions together, to go a little bit deeper in who and what God is. I'm sure those were some amazing wonderings that you shared together as a family. Now, it's time for roses and thorns, highs and lows. Take time to pause and think about something that was hard, that was rough, prickly for your week and share it together. Then take time to give thanks for something that was good, that was a rose, that was a high. As always, you can pause the video so that you all have time to share together. Thank you so much for worshiping with me today and all days as we learn about God. I am so happy for our community. Even when we are not together physically, we can still do worship together in new and different and exciting ways. As we head into the rest of the week, I encourage you to look around and think about who and what God is and where you see God manifest in our world. Join me in prayer. Awesome God, we may not fully understand all of you, but one thing we do understand is that you are always with us. When we are scared or nervous, you are with us. When we are happy and playful, you are with us. Lord, help us to see glimpses of you and understand just who and what you are in our lives. Amen. <laughs>